What's it gonna take? Tell me what you need. Will you be afraid when you wake up? What's up guys, I'm Johnny Orlando, and today I'm gonna show you how to make protein pancakes. But I'm not very good at cooking, so we'll see how this goes. All right guys, it's flipping time. Let's go. We're gonna have a mix of little and big ones. This is a trick for how to crack an egg and never get a shell in. We're making protein pancakes with our, our plant-based protein powder because it's really easy to make, so I've heard. I've never done it before. And high in protein, pretty high in calories, which is good because I'm trying to be buff. I'm in a lean bulking stage, so this is perfect for me. Of course, you can like substitute things out. We're using dairy, yogurt, and like normal milk um, and stuff, so you can all swap those out. Should be good, let's get into it. My sister taught me this recipe. So these are the ingredients that we're using today. First we have plant-based protein powder, French vanilla flavor, my favorite. We have oats, of course, 2% milk, cinnamon, low-fat yogurt, and eggs. Let's get right into it. All right. First up, we want to do all of our dry stuff together, so we're going to go with a cup of oats. Next up, we want a scoop of our protein powder. One scoop has 24 grams of protein. Oh, never mind, 15 grams of protein. I can't read. Um, so pretty high in protein, and we're putting in uh, yogurt and milk and uh, eggs and stuff, so extra protein. Not bad for some pancakes and they're pretty tasty too. Our first question here is what is the most fun I've had in lockdown? Or what was the most fun thing I've done in lockdown? I would probably have to be uh, being able to do sessions even if they were on Zoom, that was really fun. I also did um, a drive-in concert in uh, fall of last year. That was really fun. It was really nice to be able to do a show and not have to worry about anything because we were we were pretty far away from people. I'm kind of just going to eyeball this. That should be good. My dream musical collab. I'm sorry, there's protein powder in the air around me. I really want to do a flip of Thank You by Dido. I guess that would be kind of a collab. Um, I just more kind of want to repurpose old songs and like add verses and my own take on them. Uh, probably Billie Eilish though, if, if anybody, like Dream Musical Cloud, Billie or, or Bieber, I feel like it would be pretty sick. A song that always cheers me up is, uh, it's an EDM song, it's called Oblivion. Banging song. Um, it goes like, where'd you want to go? What you wanna see? Who you gonna hold when you wake up? What's it gonna take? Tell me what you need. Will you be afraid when you wake up? Make a million, take you to oblivion. I think this is done, so let's move on to the wet ingredients. Trip. Um. Now on to the wet phase. I'm gonna do two eggs. I was recommended to do like one, maybe two, but I'm gonna do two. It's protein. Um, that garbage smells like garbage. This is a trick for how to crack an egg and never get a shell in. You want to do it on the counter, like on, on a hard surface. Oh no! You want to do it on a hard surface, but um, you don't really want to clean up off your counter, so I usually crack it in the this part where it flips open, so you just go and bibbity boppity friggin' boom, and there's no shells in there whatsoever. Pretty handy. My favorite song of my own, I really like Everybody Wants You. Honestly, I like that song the more that I hear it. I liked it, but I didn't love it when it like first came out and we were doing the mix and stuff. But I like, I love it now, it's a good song. It's just kind of like a pop banger. It goes, um, everybody wants you, na na na. That's how it goes. I'm kidding, it goes, you and I both know. They want to take you home. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm looking for paper towel over here. So we still have our two eggs in here. I have not mixed them up yet. Before you do that, you're gonna wanna add just a dash of milk. 
A bit, bit more of a dash. Perfect. It's better to underdo it than overdo it, because you can't undo and overdo, but you can remedy and underdo. We're gonna sideline our milk for now and our eggs. Supreme egg tip. Tip forward and as if you're gonna eat it. Like that. And you wanna crush up the yolks first, get it started, get some movement, and then boom. You really wanna get air into the mixture so you're up like this. It's like an elliptical orbit. It's like the moon. And after that, you have a bunch of air bubbles and it tastes better, fluffier. I think the best part of shooting that I don't video was the cars. That was a, that was a, a selling point for me. Love driving. I really liked the concept of the video and being there being able to, to do it with another artist was really cool as well. Dubs was in there, and of course Ellie was there as well. And it was just a fun day overall, and I hadn't been having too many of those in music. It's a lot of just like sessions, meetings, but we got to, got to do music video, play around a bit. It was lots of fun. I'm a really good driver, actually. Um, I am, I promise. I am, I'm a really good driver, ask my friends, when I want to be, I'm very docile, and I'm very good, but I can also be a demon when I want, which is the, that's how you know you're a good driver, when you can do both. This doesn't look nice. A substitute for yogurt uh, in your very own protein pancakes could be mashed bananas, uh, but I decided to go with yogurt today. We're gonna use about one tablespoon, like this. Just scoop this out, because we're not going in for another one. My go-to convenience store snack, probably Doritos, M&Ms, big one, or uh, like beef jerky. It smells terrible, but it tastes heavenly. Ew. <laughs> Ew, dude. Look at that, ew. I just put the frying pan on the stove so it can heat up while we're finishing up these last couple steps. You wanna put it on medium heat and you want a fat pan. And then we're gonna, we're gonna deal with this. I don't know what we're gonna do yet. Now we're gonna combine these two products and we are gonna mix the dry with the wet. So let's go on and pour that in here. And while we're doing this, Am I more of a day or a night person? I would just say a, a night person. Um, most definitely not a morning person. Oh, I'm supposed to be mixing. Just nothing good happens before noon. So why would I be awake for that? No, but I do wake up at seven for school. So at this point we can kind of see what we need. I'm gonna add a bit more moisture into our mix. Um, because it's a bit dry in here. A bit, bit dry. Something I'm, I'll never regret is um, being like snappy sometimes. Because I have learned to get what you want, you have to be vocal about it. Which I don't like doing, because I don't love confrontation. I was in a session earlier today and I was like, like I just hate those ad libs, like we gotta take them out. And I felt kind of bad because it was the guy's idea that I said that to. I was like, I'm sorry, man, it's just not me. And he was like, all right, like I understand. If you have a good reason, don't be afraid to, to be snappy once in a while. All right, guys, so this is the texture that you want. Much more watery, not watery, but just it moves, it definitely moves. We were lazy and didn't blend our oats, but if you want, just toss your oats in the blender and then uh, this becomes a lot easier, to be quite honest. Also, I had an idea. I'm gonna add cho 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 chocolate chips. Don't be afraid to be generous with your chocolate chips. I'm gonna be very generous. Uh, and then repeat the last step, just mix a bit. Get them in there. So, I added a bit of oil as a base layer. We're gonna add a bit more. Mother. 
Now we're gonna make a couple different circles. Now what you're gonna do, get, grab your spoon and you're gonna make a couple different little circular pancake shapes. Make sure you do it slowly though because they expand like no other. We're gonna have a mix of little and big ones. So this is a big one. I'm gonna shape it. It's as ow that hurt. You may have to do the overhand crane technique to avoid getting splashed by hot oil. <laughs> a trick to make your pancakes a bit fluffier. <laughs> a trick to make your pancakes fluffier is to cover them. So you go like that on medium to low heat so they don't burn and they'll fluff right up. Just you watch. What do I look for in a girlfriend? And to be honest, I have no idea because I haven't had a girlfriend since I was 12. I'm really not looking for one. But um, I don't know, I guess somebody that I just get along with. Don't have to like force conversation, things like that. Like I hate having to like nails on a chalkboard to like have a good time. So. Just somebody that's easy to get along with, that I vibe with, and that's nice. The next question is, have I ever told somebody I love them? Definitely, for sure, in my, in my younger years. For sure, I was very dramatic. All right guys, it's flipping time, um, and time for more questions. Let's go. How do I handle heartbreak? I have not had my heart broken ah, in a while. Um, Honestly, just don't be weird about it and like stalk the person. Just kind of just deal with it. If it isn't meant to be, it's not meant to be. Just let it be how it be. My dogs are over there, they're making a lot of noise. Boom, expert flip. These are gonna be so burnt, man. Do you have any secret talents? I'm trying to learn how to flip my ring between my fingers, so come back in a year and 17 you guys will get the exclusive I can like figure things out pretty well. I'm about to go put together a power washer. That's about it There's really not much else about me. I kind of spend all my time doing school and music I can lick my elbow, but I'm not gonna show you I can rhyme with orange perfectly, but I'll never tell you what the word is Okay, these are done Make sure you check out I don't and the I don't video. Hi guys <laughs> <laughs>